Uh, excuse me, what are we doing? We don't want another leash chewed up. Yeah, now there's good days when we walk with the huskies and they're totally behaved and calm like earlier today, but oh no. Now we're like, I'm not done chewing up this leash. Oh my God. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully you can hear me. The cars are kind of loud. We're gonna turn down the side street in a minute. Ow, ow, Razor, no. <laughs> Nobody, there we go. Okay, he's done. Yeah, my boyfriend tied this one up. The other one went in the trash, but uh, he's like, no, I don't want that big mud. I want the leash to be uh, totally torn. Hey, 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 that's enough now. That's enough. I'm gonna walk now. Yep, one will be behaved. And the other one won't be behaved, or what all the, the other one won't be behaved, or nobody will be behaved. And then mommy gets mad, or everybody's behaved. Yeah, see, now you're kind of tangled, so that solved that problem. So here we go. So I uh, want to show you, hopefully I won't drop my phone. If you can see this uh, weatherproof sweater, I got this for, I think, six bucks at Goodwill. Oh my God, it's like polyester, a little bit of spandex, super warm, super soft, just uh, lightweight, which is what I like when I walk. But uh, here, let's go this way. Whoa, thank you. Uh, now they're good about crossing the street. He's tangled, I'm gonna have to untangle. But yeah, great, I also got this uh, cool little mushroom hat, which was brand new at Spencer's uh, at Goodwill, and I got a uh, Harry Potter Marauder uh, scarf, which is one that's a uh, one piece, which I wanted, not a scarf that unravels. I can show you that next video. Uh, no, excuse me, no scrounging. Let's go, I'm gonna keep that under, it slows them down right now. So. Uh, Anyway, we are training. Yesterday we did seven miles, day before 6.5 miles. Uh, today the um, little one's still having some uh, uh, diarrhea. We gave him an anti-diarrhea from the vet. Uh, so it was ridiculous. Yeah, don't uh, definitely don't touch that. So uh, I've been doing like short uh, walks every hour. So yeah, kind of exhausting. We were doing that till late last night too. I only got like three hours sleep. So right now on the watch, it looks like I only have, come on guys, focus, 3.7 miles. So I still have to do a couple more before the day's out. So it may only be uh, five miles today. Uh, I had to download all the photos off my phone too and clean everything up because I got to transfer phones. Anyway, um, you guys ready? I gotta untangle them now. So anyway, uh, get out and train also in the cold. Uh, train in the dark, we do a lot of that. It's kinda dark out right now. Uh, train when it's raining, train when it's too hot out, and bring less water to get kinda used to what it feels like to be a little dehydrated. Not to the point you're gonna get collapse and die, but uh, just to get used to uh, the different conditions. Don't don't train on a treadmill in the gym for the PCT exclusively because it, you've got to really just get used to being outside having a pack on, even though I only have a little pack right now because my back's hurting and I'm tired today. Oh, like I said, we got three hours sleep. But anyway, we're trying to train. We do a lot of night training as well. Um, okay, you guys, you know what? When we go over to the fire hydrant, I'm going to put my phone away. So... Yeah, these guys are always ready to go, man. <laughs> They're always ready for a walk, so perfect training partners. <laughs> um, too bad they couldn't go both with me on the PCT. That would be great with my boyfriend, but it is what it is. It's a, gonna, looks like it's going to be a horrible high-packed snow year this year, which I was not looking forward to. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye. All right, guys. Whoa, whoa.